join us and discover beautiful beaches, rugged landscapes, pretty towns, desolate mountain ranges that sweep down to stunning lakes, unique architecture, history and folklore, no shamrocks, no shillelaghs and definitely no shenanigans, just naked Ireland. The pretty town of Strangford sits on the inlet to the lock of the same name. There's references to Strangford or Strong Fjord as early as 830 AD and as the name of the town suggests it has a connection with the Norse Gaelic sea king Magnus Olufsen or Magnus Burlegs Olufsen as he's more curiously called. It is just under 500 inhabitants, a nice restaurant. A nice pub. And the buildings are painted in nice colours. But Strangford's a place where you catch the ferry across a stretch of water called the Narrows over to Port of Ferry, the town on the other side. And that's what we're going to do now. Current strong out here in the narrows and the boat makes a kind of a crescent trajectory in order to get to the other side. So when we arrive on the other side we'll be in the end of the Ards Peninsula. drive through Port of Ferry again reveals another pretty little town. The town has a small 16th century castle and some nice Georgian buildings as well. But it has more than its fair share of pubs. Spent a few good nights in that one, for example. So now we walk back down to the seafront. Past more really lovely pubs. Here we are back at the Narrows. Strangford now on the other side. 
and you can see our ferry returning to Strangford in the distance. Such a beautiful place this, and as the light begins to fade. 